Hello everyone. In this video, we will be learning how to find simple interest using few examples. So before starting, let us understand what is simple interest. For this, let us consider an example here that you have borrowed a loan of rupees P for 4 years at a rate of 2% from a bank. 2% per annum means 2% per year. So after 4 years, you will be paying to the bank your principal amount plus some extra amount which is called interest. This is called simple interest. This is the amount which you have to pay apart from the principal amount after the allotted time. You can say that it is an extra amount which the bank or the lender will take for giving money for 4 years. So this is called simple interest. It is an extra amount which you have to pay apart from the principal amount for borrowing a loan from the bank. So let us now solve few examples and find out simple interest. So our first example here is to find the simple interest on the principal amount of rupees 6400 at a rate of 6% for two years. First of all, we'll write the formula for simple interest. The formula for simple interest is principal times rate of interest times time divided by 100. In this formula, the rate of interest is in percentage. Here, our values are P is the principal amount, which is equal to 6400. R is rate of interest, which is 6% per annum. And time is 2 years divided by 100. So, these two zeros get cancelled with these two zeros. So, we are left with 64 times 6 times 2, which is equal to 64 times 12 and 64 times 12 is 768. So the simple interest is rupees 768. This is our final answer and this is the simple interest we are going to pay after two years. Let us solve one more example. So in our second example, we have been given principal amount as 2650 rupees. Rate of interest is 8% and time is 2.5 years. So we will apply the formula here which is P times R times T divided by 100. Principal amount is 2650. Rate of interest is 8%. And time is two and a half years. We'll convert this two and a half years into a improper fraction. So this will be two times two, four, four plus one, five. So this is five by two years. T we'll put five by two years times hundred. So here this zero gets cancelled with this zero. Five times one and five times two is ten. Two times four is eight and 2 times 2 is 4. We are left with 265 times 2 which is equal to 530. So our simple interest is 530. So our final answer is rupees 530. This is the simple interest we are going to pay after two and a half years. So this is how you can find simple interest by using the formula. I hope this video is helpful to you. If you like the video, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more math videos. Thanks for watching.